Honeybees are the state insect of New Jersey. Did you know that? In recent years, they've had a tough time with their own pandemic of sorts, causing what's called colony collapse disorder, which threatens their population. That makes the work of beekeepers more important than ever. News 12's Brian Donahue met with a Ridgewood man who wrote a new book that makes the bee life seem very enticing. Yeah, and the smells, the sounds. Amid the buzz of honeybees and the sweet smell of fresh honey, Frank Mortimer is in his happy place. And just see how mellow they are. And that's like the, the thing that I like to show people is that bees aren't like they were in cartoons where like this big giant fist is gonna come out and get you that they're just all mostly want to just keep doing what they're doing. Mortimer is a beekeeper, yes, but also a bee person, as in the title of his new book, Bee People and the Bugs They Love. So she's laying an egg right now. Wow. See how she put her tail in there? The book tells a story of how a presentation on backyard beekeeping Mortimer attended at a Bergen County library sparked his lifelong passion for beekeeping documents his success and failures and his journey from newbie to certified master beekeeper and also the colorful characters he meets in the world of New Jersey beekeeping. I didn't know what to expect like it, and what's funny is like when I when I started keeping bees it was I just really had a desire to be around a big ball of stinging insects so I didn't even think of the people aspect but what I found since then is that the people that are attracted to keeping bees tend to be individuals, which tends to be a lot of characters. In his book, Mortimer writes, so quote, the, during the bee-less years of my life, I always felt like something was missing, a void I needed to fill. He describes the experience of working with bees as one of a meditative flow state where you're so focused on their world that our world disappears. And as he gave me a tour of his hives here in Glenrock, I could see what he meant. Oh my God, I could, st I could see why you get into this because I could stare at these, <laughs> Yeah, right? It's just so mesmerizing. Frank the bee man has also gotten his daughters Svea and Ella into beekeeping. They have their own hives already. And the drone has one job to marry the queen. Really, that's it? That's their only job? To marry the queen. Marry the queen? Yeah. And when the four years old, they die. Yep, just like their father, bee people. I'm Brian Donahue. This is Positively New Jersey. Okay, I give it to Brian, and his daughters are just adorable, but so brave. I don't know if I could do that. Whew. Mortimer gives regular educational presentations about beekeeping. You can find more info on that and the honey that his bees make at frankthebeeman.com.